Wheaton Chambers was an American actor during the 1930s, 1940s and 1950s. Prolific, he appeared in over 200 films and television series during his career. Life in Korea Chambers was born on October 13, 1887, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Chambers made his film debut in the small role of a servant in the 1935 film The Florentine Dagger. Over the next 23 years he would appear in almost 150 feature films. Some of his more notable roles include, as Dr. Alan in Marshall of Laredo, one of the series of Red Rider films, as Louis Havina in the 1946 fantasy horror film The Flying Serpent, as Jasper Braden in Stagecoach to Denver, a 1946 western directed by R. G. Springsteen, as Dr. William R. James in the 1951 film Noir the Prowler, starring Van Heflin, as Sam Wilkins in the 1952 western West. Wagons West, starring Rod Cameron, and as Doc Runyon in The West and The Peacemaker. Other notable films in which Chambers appeared include, the 1936 biopic, The Story of Louis Pasteur, starring Paul Muni, as a lawyer in Cecil B. D. Malaise Reap the Wild Wind, starring Ray Milland, John Wayne, and Paulette Goddard, as a reporter in the 1943 version of the classic. Phantom of the Opera, starring Nelson Eddy, Susanna Foster, and Claude Rains, in the Abbott and Costello comedy. Abbott and Costello in Hollywood, Michael Curtis, 1945 classic, Mildred Pierce, starring Joan Crawford, Jack Carson, and Zachary Scott, in the 1945 Rodgers and Hammerstein musical, State Fair, starring Jean Crane and Dana Andrews, the 1945 romantic comedy Lover Comeback. Starring George Brent and Lucille Ball, Curtis, 1946 biopic about Cole Porter, Night and Day. Starring Cary Grant and Alexis Smith, the classic film noir Lady in the Lake. Starring and directed by Robert Montgomery, the 1948 classic version of The Three Musketeers. Starring Jean Kelly. Lana Turner and June Allison, the 1949 Fred Astaire and Ginger Rogers musical The Barclays of Broadway, Dee Malaise 1950 epic, Samson and Delilah, starring Hedy Lamarr and Victor Mature, the science fiction classic The Day the Earth Stood Still, starring Michael Rennie and Patricia Neal, Elia Kazan's classic East of Eden, starring Julie Harris, James Dean and Raymond Massey, and the 1956 classic western The Fastest Gun Alive, starring Glenn Ford, Gene Crane and Broderick Crawford. In addition to his feature film work, Chambers also appeared in several film shorts and film serials. The serials in which he appeared include, as Dr. Humphrey in Drums of Fu Manchu, as Boswell in Adventures of Red Rider, as Professor Benjamin in The Purple Monster Strikes, as Wilson in The Crimson Ghost, and in the featured role of Caleb Baldwin in Son of Zorro. Chambers' debut on the small screen was in the featured role of Father Batista in the eighth episode of the classic television western, The Lone Ranger, in 1949. Other television shows he appeared on include, two episodes of The Roy Rogers Show in 1952, in different roles, as a member of the Kryptonian Council on the first episode of Adventures of Superman, on two episodes of Hopalong Cassidy in 1952-53, as Mr. Kennedy in a 1954 episode of The George Burns and Gracie Allen Show, and a 1957 of the crime drama Dragnet. Chambers' last performance was in a small role in the 1958 film, Gunman's Walk, starring Van Heflin and Tab Hunter. Chambers had worked on the film in December 1957, and it was released in July 1958, six months after his death on January 31, 1958.